Hi, I'm Stephen Blake. I live in the UK, and if you have, uh, if you suffer from any of the illnesses above, I think I've got some good news for you. I have done some research into the first one of these, uh, called ME. Um, I know in America they often refer to it as chronic fatigue syndrome and uh, I know there's arguments about what it's called and diagnosis and everything else but um, to me uh, those three can be dealt with in the same way as I believe that I've actually found uh, what is the root cause and you'll know yourself that um, that the illness is aches and pains and chronic fatigue and like nobody would believe and it affects you in such a way that it's the most horrendous debilitating illness and um, I do believe that I've got to the root cause of it and that I understand it and my theory came from trying to uh, look into this to research it for a friend of mine and uh, she would had it for 20 years and I just looked to see if I could help with the symptoms or whatever and uh, when I uh, took it on I thought well this is a major thing because there was so many different symptoms no two people have the same thing and it just looked an horrendous thing and then I discovered that um, most of the people who have it seem to have uh, such a similar story and the way it starts and the way it progresses uh, seems to be consistent across all those and I did uh, manage to get some videos of people who uh, reported that they recovered from it and I studied those and saw what the same things were within that and I formulated a theory and the theory is quite simple and I then my friend called two weeks later after she'd mentioned this and I'd researched it and um, I told her I thought I understood it well enough and took her through how I thought she felt and what I thought she the stages of it and she agreed with me and she said how do you know that how did you get in my head uh, uh, it was really on the basis that everybody uh, in those three different categories of, the, of a similar illness um, goes through the same things and um, I did a small intervention I, I explained what I thought explained my whole theory and did a small intervention with hypnosis and a few days later she said that she felt a lot better um, and then I didn't hear from her for a while and then a few uh, weeks later she reported that her activity levels had vastly increased and she was looking for work um, she already had a small part time job that she was allowed to stop at any time when the pain got to her and she's now looking for extended hours and another uh, part time job um, she's now reporting, this is some three months later, that she feels she's completely free of the illness and uh, she's started to, uh, well sorry, she is now behaving as though she is free of the illness. There is of course the fact that she's had 20 years of not doing large amounts of activity so I have suggested that she uh, tries to sort of control it a bit. Um, Otherwise, she'll end up with aches and pains just from the fact that her muscles aren't used to moving uh, so much. And she took that on board. And now I regularly see her uh, on Facebook, and she's been partying and doing all sorts of things. Um, just wonderful to see it. And she's got 20 years to catch up on. Um, I then happened to talk to somebody in the same field as me who uh, was interested and I told her about this, uh, this wonderful thing that had happened and uh, she, I didn't know but she suffered from M ME and I told her my theory on it and said I would uh, help her in any way I could and I didn't see her for about five six weeks and uh, she was already starting to recover from the illness and uh, activity levels were getting better and so on just based on the explanation 
and then I did a small intervention with hypnosis and um, I managed to uh, help her in, in a way that she now reports that she thinks she's free of the illness and that is about two months ago. So um, two out of two ain't bad is it? But I can't say it's a cure. All I can say is well out of the two people I've tried to help, both report that they are free of it. Whether that's temporary or whether that's permanent, I think it will be permanent, but um, I don't know. So, why am I talking to you? I'm talking to you because I want to carry out some sort of major test of my theory. And to do that, I want people with the doctor on board who will actually then assess from your files and has diagnosed you and everything else and then um, before you come to see me because obviously if I can tell you about it and it makes you feel better it's going to mess up the medical results so um, I'm going to set something up and some way of actually contacting your doctor get a form to for you to download or something and then you can share with me um, what the issues are I'm going to build up a better picture of how it varies between people and uh, if you tell me what it is that you, how you suffer and everything else, then perhaps I can help you and hundreds if not thousands of people like you. Um, so my site's just below my chin there, you can see, so tap into that. I've only just built it as a page, it's rather crude at the moment. I'm just trying to find some way to actually help as many people I can in the next year. This is the 9th of January 2012 and I hope the next time you see a video from me that I can give you some sort of backup rather than anecdotal and um, I hope for some of you you'll come and join me and try and sort of rid people of this illness and help everybody on the path to recovery and uh, I look forward to hearing from you. Speak soon. Thank you and take care. Thanks. Bye.